Good morning. Today is Monday, uh, August 9th, and it's a new week, um, a new day for walk and worship, and I was ready. I'd had a weekend off. We went away for a funeral for the weekend, and um, it was a beautiful service. It was um, a great day to see uh, Sister Alberta off and um, we know that she had a hope and um, her hope was in Jesus Christ so we can rest assured that we'll see her again because our hope too is in Jesus Christ we've um, accepted Christ as our Savior and um, we know that we will we have that assurance of um, eternal life and it's not because we said a prayer and we were done um, we didn't just accept Christ in our hearts so that we could go to heaven. Um, that might have been our intent, <laughs> but um, we allowed the Lord to change us. And, um, and, and again, it's not because of what we've done. It's only because of what he's done. And if, if I accepted Christ on my deathbed, I could still be assured that I would have that um, promise and that I would see um, I would have eternal life in heaven and um, what happens after I get there I'll tell you when I get there <laughs> but anyway um, it was just it was good to see family and um, meet family people I didn't know and um, it was just good to lean on each other be there for one another um, maybe just grow a little bit in our own spirits you know as far as learning to love one another even when it's hard um, so I say all that to say today is Monday August 9th a new week and um, I am I know I look tired <laughs> I am tired I got my two miles in it didn't hurt as bad as Friday and I don't think it had to do with the food because I ate different this weekend. I didn't eat as good as I normally do, um, or at, at the last past month and a half or so. Um, I don't want to say normally. <laughs> normally got me where I'm at, right? Um, but the new habits that I've made. So um, now um, I'm thinking it was the rest that made me feel good, that gave me the energy to walk with um, new strength so rest is important people I believe it I believe it um, so what did the Lord have to say to me today on my walk um, well let's see there were so many things today I was listening to um, the Lord's Prayer and ah uh, if we could only focus on one thing let it be him let it be him and how holy he is our Father who art in heaven, right? He is the only one worthy of our praise. Thank you, Lord, for creating us, creating the earth and the heavens and creating all that is here. <laughs> Everywhere we are reminded of your beauty. Everywhere we look, there's creation around us and life that you put here on this earth. So um, today, I am thankful for who he is and um, he is all I need and when I forget that all I have to do is start to pray our Father who art in heaven he, you are all I need Lord and then you know continuing through that prayer that um, Jesus taught us to pray he taught his disciples and therefore they taught one another and we are the um, uh, those that get to learn it from them and teach others. So let's bow our heads and pray. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. Forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation but deliver us from the evil one. For thine is the power and the glory and the kingdom
forever. Amen. Amen. All right. God bless. Have a great day.